so satan uh, is firstly not uh, been uh, you know he uh, his head has not been crushed at calvary as many believers teach the devil's head had not been crushed yes the prophecy of genesis 3:15 has not yet been fulfilled it will be fulfilled at the second advent of jesus christ and uh, that also uh, there also it would be partially fulfilled and it would be totally fulfilled at the end of the millennial reign of jesus christ when satan will be cast into the lake of fire where he will burn forever and ever so the charismatics who teach that the lord jesus christ crushed the devil's head on calvary are wrong in teaching that the devil's head has not been crushed he is very active he is alive he is very powerful and he is our enemy he is the enemy of our souls so if you have been wondering why we have been doing these studies on uh, evil spirits right uh, fallen angels and also about satan today well we should know our enemy and we should know everything we can about our enemy in order to win the spiritual warfare that we are engaged in right we have done a detailed study of uh, the flesh and how to overcome the flesh and that's also in order for us to overcome uh, or rather to win the spiritual warfare that we are engaged in so it is good for us to know our enemies satan <coughs> uh is our enemy he is an enemy of god he is the enemy of the lord jesus christ and he hates born again christians and he would do everything in his power to destroy them but the bible tells us that god well well he is our enemy he is a defeated enemy certainly because the lord jesus christ right uh, died for our sins was buried and rose up again when he rose up he rose up victorious over sin and death and the devil has the power of death and the lord jesus christ has defeated that so the devil is a defeated foe and the bible has a lot to tell about uh, the devil and that's one reason why we should study whatever we can from the bible about uh, our enemy uh, the devil